Hi everyone, I am Mohamed and I am going to present my latest experiment in this video. Well, this thing, as I checked in the internet, is called the heliostate. It directs the sunlight to a predefined target, which is this paper here. It's composed of this base, rotating base that rotates, starting from this zero position, it rotates 180 degrees. And attached to this base is a mirror that also rotates 180 degrees. Well, the base is moved by a stepper motor, this one here, while the base, well, the mirror, I mean, is, uh, is moved by a DC motor with the help of a potentiometer that works as a position sensor. So this device here, this apparatus, is nothing more than a servo. But because I didn't have a servo at hand when I built this circuit, I had to build one myself. Also attached to the axis of the mirror is a <coughs> screw this this thing that with the help of an LDR it helps determine the position of the sun in the sky. The electronics used here are the Atmega 16 microcontroller. Um, uh, this uh, stepper motor control driver, the uh, L298. These ICs, these two ICs, I'm using one of them. I honestly I forgot its name but it is <laughs> Uh, each one, each one of these I, two ICs is a dual uh, half bridge, so it is sufficient to run the DC motor. Other things are the battery, or, uh, voltage regulator, switch, USB ASP programmer, and a small LCD. It's uh, two line by 16 characters. So let's turn it on. See how it works. When I turn on and press this button, it will, it will perform two sweeps, horizontal and vertical sweep to obtain two angles. And using those, these two angles, it will calculate uh, the uh, theta and phi of the sun. And uh, also, the theta and phi of the target are stored in the program. So, using these two theta and phi, it will calculate the theta and phi of the mirror, of the normal of the mirror, and will, uh, will direct the base and the mirror to meet these two angles. Okay, now let's see it working. Here it is performing the horizontal scan and then the vertical scan. Should now direct the sun to the target. Here we go. It's working fine. Okay, I'll rotate the whole board and when I do that, nothing for the circuit, nothing for the device is changing but the position of the sun because everything is attached to the board. The sensor, the base, the motors, the target, everything. So now this is another angle and we'll do it again. Yeah, here we go. Working very nicely. Uh, yet a third angle. Yes, very nice. Let's take another angle. Nice. It's just hitting it. It's, I think it's obvious. Okay, let's take a last angle from here. Well, these motors <coughs> consume a lot of battery. I hope we do not run on low battery soon. It's a small battery indeed. Working fine again. Well, <laughs> I might do another video to explain how this thing is working. It took me about two weeks to do it. And I did every possible mistake in C programming and trigonometry before making this far. Thank you very much.